Welcome to sports. We're going to start with golf where Steve Stricker is just in his second season on the PGA Champions Tour. And last year in Tucson, Stricker led into the final round before bogeying two of the last three holes while Tom Lehman birdied two of the last three and Stricker lost by just one stroke. Again, Stricker leads into the third round and we go to him right at 15 where he birdies to get to 14 under and the outright lead at the Colegard Classic in Tucson. Now on 16 where Stricker fell apart last year, he's going to save par to stay at 14 and hold the lead. Scott Dunlap in contention needed that par there. He would miss for a bogey and it's a two shot lead for Stricker, but Dunlap would birdie 17, down just one stroke on 18 and Dunlap's tee shot is going into the water. Ooh. Just like the Oscars, yeah, the ball shape. Of, well, yeah. All right, here's <laughs> here's Stricker's tee shot, and this one is right down the middle, an absolutely stunning tee shot. And Stricker, all he needs to do is get par to win, and guess what? He sinks it. After last year's collapse, Stricker is your winner of the Colgard Classic, and sports director Paul Sicala caught up with him after his win. With the Pac-12 tournament in basketball and the NCAA tournament right around the corner, it's no secret right now it's considered March Madness. But here in Tucson, it's also golf madness. Golf madness with the Cologuard Classic. And the winner, Steve Stricker, certainly a happy man after lifting up that trophy and putting it right on his head. We had the opportunity to catch up with him immediately afterward. For what happened with you last year down the stretch, uh, how much do you feel redemption this time around winning it all here in Tucson? Yeah, I was fighting it though. You know, I mean, it's uh, you have those demons in your head, and and uh, I knew I was fully aware of what I had to do on 18. Uh, you know, as I was playing today, I wanted to get enough of a lead where I could do something different up there. It's just a tough driving hole for me, and it is for everybody. Uh, a couple guys in my group hit in the water today. It's just, uh, if you pull it a little bit, you run through the fairway, and if you push it a little bit, you hit in the water. And it's just, it's a challenging hole, and uh, somehow I just guided it out there and got it in the fairway. And uh, I, I think even Gene Sowers hit it in the water. And um, so it's just, uh, it's a difficult hole, and I was glad to finally uh, make par on it and walk away with a helmet. Through the golf tournament and other avenues since 1962, the Tucson Conquistadores have helped raise nearly $35 million for local charities here in the Tucson area. Not too bad. Reporting from the north side here at the Coligar Classic Final, Paul Sicala, News 4, Tucson. Thank you, Paul. Coming up next in sports, Arizona basketball talks about its final home game at McHale as they get ready for Vegas.